fam, it's your girl Gladys and welcome to Is That Your Hair? I create hair, fashion, and lifestyle content that will encourage you to be your very best self. So if you're with that, you're in the right place. Today is $20 Tuesday. $20 Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute wigs for the $20 price range and below. So let's just jump right in. Hey family. I'm sure some of you... Hello. I'm so tired of these scam callers, like for real. Anywho, hello family, how are you? Drop me a comment down below and let me know how you are feeling now that we are in the 11th month of the year, November. What is your plan to end the year strong? Drop me a comment down below and let me know. As for me, I did take a little bit of time off from posting, about two weeks, just to kind of get my mind right for the end of the year. Some of you may have seen that it was C's birthday in October, and then it was my 10 year class reunion. I went to Howard University, super proud Howard alum, so I had to go celebrate with my people and I had a really good time. And then I was just like, you know, I just need to like decompress before I come back on the YT. So now I'm here and I missed you all and I'm ready to really dive in and dish out a lot of great content for you all. Of course, y'all know I have the wig reviews coming, but I definitely will have more fashion content and more vlogs as well and a little bit of makeup content because low key, your girl has been falling back in love with lipsticks. So if that's something that you're excited to see, let me know in the comments. Also, before I get into this review, speaking of things I'm excited about, yee! so one of my goals for 2021 was to go live more. I, I just haven't been completing the goal at all, but recently an opportunity came up to start going live on Amazon. So I'm taking it. I'll be going live literally every week in the months of November and December. And then once January comes around, I'll reassess how I feel about it and if I want to make it like a bi-weekly thing or just depending on what your feedback is. I'm super excited about it, so please make sure you go to my description box, click on my Amazon storefront, click that follow button because one, it helps your girl out, and two, it will automatically notify you when I'm going live. With Amazon Live, it's like a live shopping experience, if you will. We get to chit chat, talk about whatever the topic is for the day, and then do some shopping. So if you're excited about that, comment down below, and I hope to see you all this week on Thursday because that's when I'm doing my first live. Ah! So I really hope that I can see you all there. All right, y'all, let's get back into $20 Tuesday. The last time I was here with this wig two weeks ago, y'all really went crazy over it to my surprise. I had it in a natural color, which was my favorite, but y'all also really like this color too, surprisingly. And when I went to look back at the link, y'all bought all the wigs, like all the colors. Like there's only one thing left. I'm going to contact the company to see if there's going to be a restock soon, hopefully, cross your fingers. But I was like, you know what? Let me see what else that they have. And I found two wigs, both for $19 each, okay, on Amazon. One is from the same company, which is this pretty little magenta number here. And then I have a regular number two bob wig from another company so we're gonna get into it okay and just like i said last time i'm gonna talk through how i feel about the wig as i'm putting it on for y'all and from what i can tell so far this is actually pretty cute but here's the thing with some of these amazon vendors okay the wig that you get don't always look like the picture <laughs> Maybe catfish it on Amazon, seriously. And I try so hard to comb through these listings to make sure I'm not buying from a person who's stealing pictures from wig bays that I know, because that shit is fucking annoying. Like, I really need them to stop. I'm in the midst of going through Amazon's copyright infringement thing right now, and it's just ridiculous. Like, please, take your own freaking pictures. My God. But anyway. So looking at this wig, even though it looks cute in person, is it the same wig that's on Amazon? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but let's just see how it looks on me and y'all let me know what y'all think about it. Bobs are always in style, they're always in season. And for $19.99, I don't think you can beat it. So yeah, if you wanna see what it's hitting for, keep watching. All right, so this bob here comes with one comb in the front, comb in the back, adjustable straps, and it comes with the hard lace. The same hard lace y'all saw on this wig right here. If you're not for hard lace, I understand. But like I said before, I don't mind hard lace too much because it lays so flat. Like even with this right here, I did use some got to be glue, but like the hard lace just makes it lay 
so much more seamlessly. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not totally mad at it for the price. It also comes with these like little wispy baby hairs. And I like that the lace is on the brown side. Okay, so y'all, I'm going to take this cutie off okay oh, i just love this kinky texture so freaking much if you're interested in textured wigs i do have an entire playlist dedicated to them check out my description box you're bound to find something that you really really like so i'm gonna pop this off you can see the little got to be glue here we are gonna pop this bad boy right on it's giving me side part vibes the parting space is not extensive it's like maybe three inches something like that and y'all when y'all do a hard lace make sure you moisturize your edges because this lace can be very brutal on the edges like right now i was trying to snatch up my braids as, as i do this okay so oh okay wait a minute wait a minute Wait a second. Hmm. I see a vision. If you see it, let me know. Premiere party. What do y'all think? This is like sassy. <laughs> Give somebody whiplash trying to play around with this wig. What? I think my mom would like this. So cute. Love will be right here. <laughs> okay, y'all. I'm 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 feeling what's happening here with this unit. I think we're about to make this, we're about to make something shake right now. I'm gonna let the music come in. I'll be right back with my final thoughts. I wish that they would just stop sweating me. Stop trying to get the best of me. No matter what they say, baby. Gotta move on cause we're gonna be Bob. Back when I used to get relaxers, I remember getting my hair cut just like this. I feel like this is looking super realistic. So for my girls who have a lighter density of hair, I'm sure this will look pretty realistic on you. This definitely is giving me more of a mature vibe. I switched out for my shirt so that way you can guys see the hair better. And I think it's actually pretty cute. This is a nice yakky texture. I really like that it came with layers, but of course y'all know me, I did snip a little extra just to layer it a little bit better for my liking. I think the parting space is looking pretty decent. What do y'all think? Let me know. The only thing is I kind of wish the bang was banging, you know what I mean? Like I keep trying to flip it, make it do something different. I would definitely have to use like hairspray in order to make the bang do something else overall i think she's cute you could tuck her behind your ear if you want yeah but here's the one con to this unit this does not look like what's on the website <laughs> this wig is a catfish look at the picture is this the way that's on my head no that's the thing with some of these vendors on amazon sometimes it's like a box of chocolates you just don't know what you're gonna get and that's not fair like the picture that you are using should be the actual picture of the wig. That's a con to me. I don't I don't like that. But you know, I'm still here showing it to y'all because yeah, I already have it on my head. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, what do you call it when you're catfish, but then you actually like the catfish? What what is is there a feeling? Is there a name for that? I, I don't even know what to say. You should never call me a fan ass Kelly Price. 
all those, I keep whipping my hair back and forth. Let me know what y'all think in the comments, uh, because I don't know, I feel conflicted. She's cute, but she's low key a lie. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I am back with this very pretty pink bob. Now, before I get into my thoughts on this unit, quick little update on my catfish unit earlier. So I recently started doing a dance class called Diva Dance, and if you're interested in it, I'll leave a link in the description box because they have locations throughout the U.S. I grew up dancing, so I was like, you know what? I really need something to motivate me to work out again because even though I don't mind being a little fluffy, I should not be out of breath walking up two flights of steps. Like, that is not okay. Okay, so I need to get back active. So yeah, that's what I just started doing last week. And I decided to just wear my wig to the dance class and you'll see me here doing my little dance. With my hair back and forth. And then I realized like once I got home, I was low key feeling myself. I was in the mirror like, ooh, check you out Gladys. <laughs> And then C gave me the ultimate compliment. She told me, ooh, that looks real. Like, that was her initial reaction because she didn't get to see me before I left out. And she was on FaceTime with her friend. She was like, ooh, Gladys, what wig? That's a wig? Is that your hair? And I was like, damn, C, this wig is looking so cute, but it wasn't the wig that was in the website. That's neither here nor there, but I just wanted to give y'all that quick update. Now, back to this wig right here. The pros are absolutely the color. I like the way they did the rooting. It's not too harsh. I think it blends really well into the pink. I'm very particular when it comes to light colored units and dark rooting. I don't like when it's a harsh line. I like when it's blended in nicely like it is here. I think this looks good. I like the length of it. And y'all know that normally I'm not into asymmetrical cuts at all. But this is cute. This actually reminds me of the unit Bobby Boss Lena. That was my favorite wig of 2018. Ugh. It reminds me like down to the texture and everything. I did flat iron this just a tad because there were dents in the hair straight out the pack. Other than that, I would say this is ah uh, maybe like definitely more on the silky side, but like with a little bit of yak, like a very light yakky. Because even when I run my fingers through it, I feel slight weight in the hair. Now, does it look like the picture on the website? That wig is definitely longer than the one I have here. I just need for these renders to be transparent. I need these renders to not lie about what they're putting out there because this is a cute wig. Just plop this on a mannequin, take a picture and keep it moving. Like you don't have to make up pictures or steal pictures. That's just really, ugh. So frustrating. But let me know, what do you think about this one? I do think she is very cute. <laughs> and she's super easy. I didn't even put got to be glue in the parting space, y'all. I actually used concealer this time in the parting space with a thin brush just to make the part show up. And I did slightly trim this. Like when I say ever so slight, probably like a centimeter, not even that. It would take me a long time to color a wig like this. This isn't just all pink. There are multiple shades of pink and red in this wig. It just may not be showing up on camera. So let me know what you think about these bobs from Amazon. Who's on the website? Let me know. For both of my wigs, overall pros are that I do like the style. I just don't like that it doesn't match with the picture. I feel like that's very deceiving and consumers should be able to see what they're getting into and trust that it's the right product that they're receiving. So I think that definitely attributes to some of the negative reviews on this wig. But I'm gonna leave it up to y'all. Let me know if you like this look on me. Y'all know I really love rocking colors. I haven't been doing it much as of late, but if you need some color inspo, I'm your girl. And I actually have like a color wig playlist. I'll leave it down below. And if you're new here, May as well tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I'm super excited about the months of November and December. I have a lot of great content coming. And please make sure you check me out on Amazon Live this coming Thursday. Follow my Amazon storefront so that you can help me out and get notified about the live. And if you want to see some of my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank y'all so much for joining me for $20 Tuesday. I love y'all and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.